What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P, back with another episode of Cool Tech Under $50 for March. The series we show off some of the best tech you can find under that price point so you're not breaking the bank. If you see anything you like today, I'll have it all listed for you in the description down below so you can check it out. But also, shout out the last month's winners. I've been in contact with you from February's episode so you can claim your tech. And if you want to win something from today, all you have to do is drop a thumbs up down below, leave a comment on your favorite item and why you like it, why you find it useful. But also, make sure you're subscribed. I'm only going to pick subscribers in which only about 30% of you are. So hit that sub button as well. Now, first up, I'm always trying to find a nice, minimal, and clean looking wallet. Came across this 3-in-1 from Fidelo. You have a separate metal card holder, a leather sleeve for it, plus an included money clip. You can use them separately or all together. I have it here in the rustic brown leather colorway. They have it in a bunch of different colors on Amazon. So you can pick whatever one matches your style. Now, it's very sleek, which is what I like. It's only 13 millimeters when it's fully stacked up. And the way it works is it has this spring-loaded trigger on the bottom, pretty much. Where you press it, all your cards will lift up in an ascending order so you can see which card is which. On the top slot, you can hold up to five cards, but also on the leather sleeve, you can hold a card on each side. So seven in total, plus if you want to use it with the included cash band, which it comes with two different styles, and there's five different cash bands included, it can hold up to 10 bills. So again, seven cards in total, 10 bills in total, it's like four and a half by two and a half, so it's nice, sleek, and slim, 100% RFID blocking. For me, personally, checking off all the boxes, definitely a pretty good consideration if you're looking for a new everyday carry sleek and minimal wallet. Like I mentioned, there's like 10 different colors of leather that it comes in. You can also get it in nylon as well. So the choice is yours for just around 40 bucks. Now, another thing you may have noticed is one of the cards I'm using in here is called a dot card. This little card is like a smart business card, if you will. And with the whole dot platform, you can pretty much load up all your info, social media, email, websites, contact info, all that stuff. Whenever you meet somebody or instead of exchanging a physical business card, all you have to do is tap your dot card to their phone and it'll instantly pull up your digital dot portfolio, pretty much. It gives them all that info for you. And what's really cool is there's no app required. You don't have to download anything. And when you're setting it up, you don't even have to manually link your social media. All you do is just put in your handle and it'll do it all for you. And the cards are only 20 bucks, so nice and affordable. You can get them in like red, white, green, blue, black. You can make your own custom ones. They also have dedicated like these NFC chips pretty much you could use as well. But I think the card is just a really cool business card equivalent that you can share all your info with instantly with just one tap to their phone. Now next is the personal project and collaboration that I'm super pumped about. You may have seen it on the channel already, but you guys know, I love my keycaps, love the custom keyboards. And I teamed up with Casper Keys to make these really cool aluminum artisan caps and a nice topo themed. Some artisan keycaps can run you anywhere from like 50 to $150. Casper Keys and I teamed up to create these aluminum ones with a nice etched in topo pattern to it. We're only charging 35 bucks, plus code RFE at checkout will bring it down an extra $5 for you. You can get it in this teal colorway or black as well for the more neutral user. It's your Cherry R1 Profile keycap. Uh, the teal ones here are also custom Cerakoted, and it'll fit any MX style stem. So odds are your keyboard will be just fine. Whether you have razor key switches, Cherry, Kale, Gateron, Otemu, all of them, you'll be fine. So again, some nice little accent piece you can add to your keyboard. If you want it in black, pick that up. But of course, the teal here looking great on our custom NK65 entry keyboard that I collabed with with Novel Keys a few years back already. So a perfect addition. You may be noticing uh, we have custom topo theme keycaps on here as well. These are 75 bucks, so not under 50, but these also just launched. They're the Deep Sea topographic keycaps from Control T Keys also teamed up with them recently. We just put these keycaps out in his entire full base deep sea topographic keycap set. We also added an ISO kit as well. Your all-in-one complete base set for you guys. Again, also not going to break the bank. Some GMK sets are like $150 to $200. These, $80. But again, code RFP at checkout will knock it down an extra $5. I mean, come on. Tell me this combo here isn't looking awesome. Definitely a big fan. Again, the keycaps aren't under 50, but the novelty topo keycap is. All down below for you guys if you want to check it out. 
Now, also just in the channel, I created an RGB sort of accent wall. Over there, behind me, as you could probably see, we have a pretty crazy looking RGB display going on. And it's made entirely with these Cololite mix panels. So I figured this would also be a pretty good fit for the series. Each panel is $45. However, you can get extension panels, which are just 30. So think of like the $45 one as like the brains, that's the core panel. And then each one you add to it is the $30 extension. But you can also get a three pack for just around 90. And I think they're pretty cool looking. They're five by five inches. You have that nice circular RGB glow in the middle. You can sync them all up in the app and have different effects going on, static colors, have a pulse to music with the built-in microphone. You know the idea with these crazy RGB things. But as you can see, I have it in this massive rectangular sort of collage over in the entertainment setup, and it just looks pretty cool as this RGB accent wall. They're also magnetic, so if you have like a, a pegboard, you can stick them onto there. But you can also get pretty creative with them. They can be powered one of three ways, either USB, a battery, or a wall adapter if you're gonna be hooking up a few of these like I did. And they all come with these 3M adhesive if you want to just stick it to your wall directly. If you wanna like put it behind your monitors, get some crazy sort of, you know, accent collage going on as well, make some cool shapes. The ball is all in your court. Now I've also seen these added to people's desk setups, like physically on the desk, for certain display pieces. Like if you wanna just maybe set your mouse on it, you can do that. I've also seen people use this as like a watch display. I've seen a lot of people put their pop figures on this just to add that extra RGB glow. Cause again, you can use these wirelessly if you want to power them with a battery. Just a lot of cool versatility you get with these Cololite Mix panels. That's why I really like them. You don't have to buy a bunch of them. You can add just a few to your desk or a few behind your monitors or your wall just to give it some extra pop and glow. So again, I did an entire vlog yesterday on the channel if you wanna check out the whole process of how I created the accent wall, but some pretty cool stuff. Again, the actual physical core panel is 40 bucks, each extension is 30, or you can pick up a three pack, but either way, it's under $50. And speaking of that vlog, I've done a lot more vlogging lately, mainly because of how convenient this Ulanzi mini tripod is. There's a lot of stuff going on. It might sound boring, but it's definitely pretty cool and useful. So first up, that's a tripod. Obviously it's gonna hold your camera, has the legs that pop out, but that's nothing special. There is a built-in ball head, very convenient for, you know, orienting your camera and angling it in certain directions. You have a built-in hot shoe on the side, also great for like I have here, adding a light. If your current hot shoe is occupied on your camera, like where I have the mic, so you get that added extra hot shoe. But also, you have the telescoping, pretty much boom head built into the tripod itself. So you can get some nice depth and separation in your shots to really distance yourself and, you know, make the field of view wider. And that's just not something you typically see on these mini tripods. Now it is plastic, so keep that in mind in terms of the actual durability. I haven't had any issues, but it's also gonna mean it's lighter in return, which is gonna be great for when you're bringing it with you on the go for your vlogs. I have it in white just to match my Sony ZV-1. You can also get it in black if you prefer. But really, the main reason I picked this up and went with this is because of that hot shoe, which might seem like, you know, an afterthought, but it's a really nice bonus. Maybe your camera doesn't have a hot shoe mount on it, or maybe it's gonna be blocked by a flip up screen or something. You can add your mic to the side of here, or like I have an extra light. But the telescoping head is just definitely what sold it for me. Getting that depth and separation is clutch. Especially if you don't have a really wide angle lens when you're vlogging, this will give you that depth. So the mini vlogging tripod is only 20 bucks, which is definitely a pretty good price for this. And also, in case you're wondering, this little light cube, which is gonna be, you know, the main purpose of this is to fill in those shadows if you don't have a lot of light in your current situation when you're vlogging, this guy was also 20 bucks. And not only can you control the actual, you know, lighting color temperature and stuff, but it's got full RGB. You can do the RGB rainbow and stuff, add some extra colors, add some extra pop to whatever you're shooting or filming. It's got great battery life. This also has three hot shoes built in for more mounting slots. It charges with USB-C. You control all of it on the back, these little buttons there, very convenient, and it's magnetic. So again, when it comes to being creative, you wanna mount this somewhere for some extra color spill in your shots, this light's got your back for just 20 bucks as well. So really, for 40 bucks, this duo, will definitely do a lot to improve your vlogs. 
And guys, that'll wrap it up for this episode of Cool Tech under $50 for March. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up to show your support. And like I said, everything you saw today will be listed for you in the description down below in case you want to check it out. Feel free to hit me up and follow me on Twitter at RandomFrankP. And lastly, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Hope you all enjoyed. Have a good day.